When planning a project, project managers rely on estimates about the amount of time that activities will take and the resources needed for each activity. As such, estimates are the bricks and mortar of any project plan. Everything in our project plan is based on an estimate. We rely on these estimates in order to support good decision-making processes and to make decisions, to schedule our work, to determine how long the project should take, to determine how much the project should cost, to determine if the project is worth doing, to develop cash flow needs for our project, and finally estimates are used to develop a time phase budget and establish a project baseline. Project baselines are used to determine how well the project is progressing once the project has actually begun. One of the biggest sources of risk in a project is our time estimates. Having estimates that are too low, that is they don't have enough time for the task or activities to complete or the resources needed to complete them, is often the first worry of project managers and stakeholders and that's a valid concern. If time or resources runs out, getting more resources to finish the project can be hard and certainly has to be justified, not a fun prospect. However, if we have estimates that are too high, that is our project ends up taking much less time and resources than was estimated, that's also bad. If our estimates are too high, that means that our project will have to have its schedule dramatically altered and resources that could have been used for other projects are over allocated to our project. So it's important to understand that while we place an emphasis on getting our project done on time and our activities done as soon as possible, that doesn't mean that padding our project time estimates or having estimated too high is really a good thing. There are two basic categories of estimation techniques top-down or macro estimates use some sort of analogy, group consensus, or mathematical relationship in order to make a relatively quick but not as accurate prediction of our costs and time requirements. Bottom-up or micro estimates are made using the elements from our work breakdown structure, take a little more time to produce, but are much more accurate. So hopefully you understand a little bit about the importance of time and resource estimation for any project.